Welcome back to the channel everyone. Today we are at the Surfside Jetty here in Freeport, Texas. Uh, the last couple times we've been out here, man, the uh, fishing has been kind of dust, but we got some reports from uh, you guys that the speckled trout were biting. So we're gonna go ahead and go give it our best shot. Found us a little spot on the rocks right here, and I'm gonna get a shrimp on. We'll get our first cast out there. Before we get started, y'all go over the setup real quick. It's the uh, same deal we were using yesterday at Seawolf. Got the uh, Custom Pro by Luz 4000 spinning reel. And then we got the slip cork right now. I really do need to change my depth. I'm fishing at like probably three, in between three and four feet. And then we got the Therese rod and reel from Shimano. It's a medium power and it's a pretty good setup. Uh, should be really good for these trout out here. And uh, we just gotta wait for that bite, man. I... Let's change our depth to a little bit deeper. Fish about seven foot down. So let's see. So I got a seven foot rod here. So we go all right there should be good nice deep depth get down there where the trout can see my shrimp see something playing with my shrimp you see it it's like there we go all right y'all so our first fish of the day what is it is it a little sand trout a little croaker we had a little something playing with it. Let's see, what are you? Maybe a silver perch. Let's go ahead and get this guy off real quick. Oh man, I'm just happy to get on a fish, man. It is like, really, that was probably my second cast. Already better than I did yesterday, or at least even. Man, come on, chill out. All right, got this little guy off. Woo, and it always feels good to get on a fish really quick, man. Like I said, this place, the jetties are always real hit or miss, but today I think it's going to be a hit. We've seen a bunch of guys reeling in speckled trout on the way out here. Everyone's been saying they were doing a good job, and we're on a fish within our first 10 minutes, so it's a freaking thumbs up from me. Go, you guys this is a nice fish definitely a speck this time not no little guy it's a nice speck it's for sure a keeper let's go boys we're not keeping fish huh no see if homie wants it Uh, seven foot right now, about anywhere from seven, in between seven and six. Oh, buddy, come on. So we're, oh, awesome, thank you guys. All right, boys, so we're on today with our first fish. This guy's a wildly one. We're not keeping fish, but, uh, stop it, pal. I'm sure some guys along the rocks are going to be keeping, so we don't have to uh, be too careful with this guy's slime. I do want to get a picture with him. And after that, we're gonna go see if anybody wants this guy. Look at that, solid freaking trout. Man, oh man, what a way to start the day. Let's get the picture. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> He's trying to make a big one. <laughs> yeah. You guys keeping fish today? Yeah, here you go, man. I don't know if you want to measure him. He's for sure a keeper. Yeah, it's fine. Here you go, brother. Thanks a lot. Uh-huh, no problem. All right, you guys, and now the pressure's off. We have freaking got on a fish after that skunk yesterday. I was really worried, but I think today's gonna be a good day. I know I already said that, but that just 
that just secured the freaking deal. Let's go ahead and get on back out there. Oh my gosh, on another, on another one. Let's freaking go, you guys. A saw, he feels like a fighter again, dude. This is for sure, I mean, I don't wanna say for sure it's gonna be a keeper. What's up? Oh God. You wanna go get it? No, no, no. I think he's. There you go. Let's go, another fatty, solid. dude. Oh my gosh, boys. Solid. I'm not joking, these are like back-to-back -back cast. Oh. He got himself off. He's gonna be another keeper, you guys. So, I mean, you don't gotta worry about taking super good care of him. He definitely ripped his lip there. Talk about ripping lips. Let's go ahead and uh, get this guy over to uh, one of our buddies here. We got our... This guy does not wanna go, man. <laughs> All right, look, let's get this guy because he's a freaking savage over here. But another solid keeper. Yeah, no problem. We gotta get this guy in there quick because he does not oh, he doesn't like the ice chest. Oh. All right, we'll see you, buddy. <laughs> Woo, man! Back to back freaking cast. You gotta put on some shrimp. <laughs> I'm, getting, I'm getting hit. Dude, those are nice freaking fish. Those are some fat trout, man. All right, boys. We can go ahead and get the boga ready just in case we do get one that's not a keeper. I don't want that to happen again. Fortunately, that guy was a keeper, but handling him like that by the by the hook and line uh, he ripped his lip completely off and i would hate to send one that's not a keeper back out there like that so let's go ahead and have the fish grips ready and we can just secure them uh, nice and solid right when we get them up there we go you guys we're on another one oh yeah he feels he feels a little bit smaller than the last oh my god i think we got him foul hooked Look at that, it's a freaking horse croaker. <laughs> freaking ginormous, dude, this is a freaking big croaker, you guys. I mean, I don't think I've ever caught one this big. I don't know why I'm doing the boga right now. It's really uncalled for, but. I mean, seriously, look at this freaking thing. Stop it, buddy. Holy crap. He is croaking like no other, too. Let's get this hook out of you, pal. She has, let's get this guy back in, he is up unruly sucker he kept trying to flop out of my hands while i was getting the release but man y'all see the size of that thing is like this big there we go you guys it's been a little while since we got on our last fish and uh, i just changed my depth i was fishing at about seven we just moved down to maybe nine or ten foot let's get this guy in real quick oh no 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 we don't want to do that we don't want to do that come here buddy he looks like a keeper huh measure him all right pal come on but i wouldn't leave your rod down like that yeah i'm not all right y'all we got this guy on the bogo we're gonna go give him a quick measurement measure this guys oh, okay. Uh, okay. see if he'll keep see. 16 right is it uh it's 15 15 Where's he at? Yeah, right. Six, and a half. Yeah, yeah. He's good. Yeah. All right, y'all. We got another keeper. Let's throw him in the box. Woo! All right. <laughs> Been fishing for maybe an hour and a half, and we're working real close to a limit now. We need two more fish, two more keepers, that is, to get on our limit. And, man, what a change of pace. After getting skunked yesterday and then coming out here and having this killer time, I'm loving it, man. I am loving the Freeport jetties right now. It's a little guy. 
Yeah, you guys, this depth change has definitely turned things around for me. Oh, are we caught? Oh, okay. Yeah, he's definitely not a keeper. Here, uh, I don't want to screw him up. Well, yeah. Oh, sh nope. He is grunting. All right, I thought it wasn't a keeper. My dad says it is a keeper. We're going to get a measurement on this guy real quick. Let's get the boga. This one here. Yeah, about 15 and a half again. Awesome. Just put them in the chest, you guys. All right. Man, oh man, we got one more till we get a limit, boys. <laughs> yeah, there we go. There's no way this guy is a keeper. I'm gonna go ahead and get over here and get the boga. This is a little guy. What is it? Oh yeah, it's a very small speck. Come here, buddy. Don't want to ruin your slime, you idiot. Well, no, dude. Well, boys. Uh, I don't know if he's got a way out of there, but I tried my best to get him on the boga. Just the way she goes sometimes. Let's uh, everybody pause the video and say a quick prayer for that guy. Oh, 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 yeah. You good, buddy? Oh no. Did they kill him? I'm wondering. Yes, he's still alive. He's still alive. He gave me a little flicker of life, so we're gonna put him back out there. He got hit hard, man. This shrimp is a juggernaut. I almost don't even want to throw him back out there because he deserves better, but maybe this is a shrimp's purpose in life, is to complete the food chain and you know, be nutrients for a big trout. Maybe he does deserve this and it's his ultimate dream. Who knows? There we go. Oh man, guys, I'm on a nice one and my battery is low. I don't want it to die. Don't die on me, battery. Oh. I know. Well, <laughs> the battery didn't die, but the freaking, uh, yeah, but I lost one of them on my first cast. Dang, you guys. I, I freaking know that guy was going to be my limit and he got off right at the rocks. Oh, you know what? I'm jinxing myself. I've had a good day. Who cares about a limit? Low key. I care about a limit. All right, let's go get another. Oh, are you sure about that? This is a nice one. Uh, if you want to, uh, I don't, I'm close to my limit. This is my guy right here. Oh God, that is a big one, son. No, it's uh, not. Oh, it's a red. <laughs> Man, here I am thinking I got my limit. Dude, what is this guy doing out here? Come here, bro. <laughs> what? Of all things, a, ra a rat red. Yeah. Is there a tag on that one? <laughs> a tag? Man, if I caught a tagged red, I'd freak out. Holy crap, I cannot, do you have pliers on you? Oh, there we go. All right, you guys, a nice little red here. You got a little bloodied up on the rocks. Let's go get a nice launch on him. Make sure he gets in that water. Man, he started flopping right when I threw him. It has been an awesome day at the jetty. We're on our last couple shrimp right here. And uh, man, I already know this is gonna be one of those videos where I'm editing it and I'm trying to figure out, do I need to put all these catches in there or not? Because I do think it gets boring, just catches, catches, catches. <laughs> like that, dude, we're on another, he's on another one. And uh, man, I really, really love the days like this where, you know, after a hard week, sometimes you're not getting on them like you, you wanna be and just have an excellent day like this. It's a great start to the weekend and uh, I'm just happy. So if we catch any more, I don't know if they're going to make the video, but we're getting ready to head out here soon and uh, catch you guys on the outro. That's going to do it for this one, you guys. There's nothing, I mean nothing that can beat a hot jetty bite. I, uh, I love the jetties, man. I love going out there. It's always a good time. And uh, when the fish are biting, it makes it even freaking better. I have some of my best trips, my best memories at the jetties. Still waiting on those jacks to show up, but 
Today was definitely one of the like best days that I've had out there in a while. Nice freaking trout. Almost got our limit and even got a red. I don't usually catch reds at the at the jetty, but when I do, it's always a good time. So uh, if you enjoyed the video, go ahead and smack the like button, smack the subscribe button, and I hope y'all have a great rest of y'all's day. Peace.